Ding, 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 ding. Welcome to my video. Um, I don't know if I consider this a vlog or I just kind of want to film what I'm doing. So, come follow me. All right, so today is a day that I just kind of did my thing. I woke up at 8.30 but stayed in bed till 10.30. <laughs> and I think I continued, I think I went back and stayed there till 11. Watched my Real Housewives of New York, which I love. And it's the season finale soon, so yay, super exciting. And then I went to the gym. Go to the gym all the time. I went some grocery and um, yeah, I went to the dollar store because I'm gonna reorganize my kitchen today. And I didn't realize till I got home that the lady only scanned one out of my two containers. So girlfriend got a free container. I just did a little art project. I'm going to show you right now. Aren't these so cool? Hello, Tozies. Um, so I was looking at a, I was on YouTube and I saw, I was looking at other people's vlogs and there's one girl, I think her name was Christy Stewart, store, Christy, Christy something. I'll put it here. She's super cool. I was watching all her health videos. She's from Australia. And then she had this kind of in the background. So I was Googling other, um, I guess like naked illustration photos and thought I would do the same and... I think they're not too bad, so I'm going to put that up there above the TV, move that up, and eventually I'll make more, not just the two, but it would be kind of cool to do maybe like three, one, two, three, and then change this. So I'm just going to change all of this, also watching a movie. What do I have here? I got some containers, because I don't want to use packaged containers. And I am planning to reorganize all of these cabinets because that's what Dominique does when she has free time. So let's take a mental picture of this and uh, yeah, let's enjoy. I reorganize the cabinets. Oh my god, love it. So, I got rid of two water bottles and a mug, and I just kept what we actually need back there. So we have, I have a matcha shaker and an extra coffee mug, just in case, two water bottles, because there's only two people living in this house. Shaker bottle, that does not count as a water bottle. And I just put like our, like big, things that I don't use a lot so like maple syrup maple syrup and I like using this but since it's in the front it's easy for me to grab then whoa I cleaned this up I think I got rid of two things that were expired or like just looked like I would never use it again and these little like um, riser things are from the dollar store so useful so I have all of like my shorter items like uh, seasoning, baking stuff in here. And I like these kind of containers because they fit anywhere. And then on the top, I have like the big uh, stuff. And then anything tall on the side. And if I were to buy more stuff, 
I got room. So goodbye. Then here is pretty much all of our stuff. <laughs> so I again use a bigger or a longer riser for all of our bowls and plates. So most of this stuff is from Ikea except for like these. And I have these awesome bowls that I got from a liquidation store. It was a dollar something. So it's like bigger than a soup bowl, but it's great for pastas or salads or if you're trying to food portion. It's not too big, not too small. It's got those for like a dollar something. These are just random bowls, but I know that we use a lot, so I keep that. And then I have our mugs. I don't drink coffee anymore, so I keep that in the back. And then Clark's favorite mug here. Then on top of all of our cups, I got wine glasses, our everyday use cups, extra mugs, because you never know, and of course, shot glasses. So, goodbye. Now, on top of the stove. People, what do you put on top of your stove? It's a very weird thing. But anyways, I kind of just put everything that I use but I don't use. So I have toolbox. I have an IKEA toolbox here, screwdrivers, Allen keys, tape, flashlights, paint can opener, things like that. Then we have like a first aid kind of bin. So I went through it, got rid of everything that was expired or I don't know or I don't even use. And a nice thing here, I'm just going to take this out and show you. If you don't have a bin that you can put stuff in, or you don't like how bulky this stuff is, put them in nice little Ziplocs. Yes, we all want to be like earthy friendly and not use plastic, but if you have them already, might as well use it. And any like supplements, always make sure um, you check the expiration date. And always have band-aids. And then, this is really random, so I got toolbox, meta first aid stuff, all my tea, I'm not a huge tea drinker, but this is pretty much all my favorite teas, so I keep that there. I even have like a tea bag thing. This is from my old apartment in my office when I used to have like a makeup desk, and I have little beads in there to put your makeup brushes, so I want to keep that. And then these, oopsie, are uh, chalk paint, which is obviously not finished. So this is kind of random, but it's a lot more organized, and I use more of the space, so I stack these, stack, stack stack so this I mean I could do better but the food processor used to be above the oven and it was like so wonky and did not maximize the space at least here it's open I see it that whole thing is pretty much food processor stuff then down here I just have I have a bag of like gifting things so like tissue paper stickers tape all that manuals that came with the house for the kitchen. I have little oven element things, some rags, laundry bag stuff, and laundry stuff. So I have, no, this is not butter. This is a container that I'm using for our detergent. Extra detergent, because it's always gonna have extra in that. I don't have a microwave, but there's no really point of throwing this away because eventually I will have a microwave. So I'm gonna just keep that, or I could put it in storage. But still, compared to before, is a lot more room. Hello. <laughs> All right, I am going to attempt to make protein balls. I will show you the photo here. You see me? And uh, yeah, let's. Uh, I thought I'd just film me making it.
look. Oh my God, look at that coconut. <laughs> Okay, let's try it. So these would be great if after a workout or a light snack, I really just wanted something I could put in a container or a, or a baggie and then just bring it to work or with me instead of like buying and buying and buying freaking junk food. So let's try this one. Here we go. <clears throat> oh my God, it's so good. Butter. I like it. If you like it, please make it and tell me if you like it. 